guys, how's it going? This is Asin here from Hashtag. And today, I'm making a review of the CM13 ROM on the Samsung Galaxy S4, as I have it over here. And uh, this is the ROM itself. So starting off uh, with the differences in the lock screen. As you can see, the clock is a bolder font, and instead of a call shortcut you now have a voice assist icon so you have the voice assist icon and you can obviously still swipe up to unlock and these are the apps now the apps are basically the same but the op app opening animation is different as you can see it springs to life from the app like that and the app drawer now is vertical scro scrolling and it has four shortcuts up here and the notification panel is now dual pane and you can just edit it from right over here and the settings are on this side and uh, what are the other differences well now getting on to the marshmallow features number one is the doze mode when your device is sitting idle within 1200 milliseconds it will go to sleep and that does not mean that it will turn off but it will turn off some system resources which will uh, make your phone uh, run in standby for a lot a lot longer than before and the second uh, feature which we need to enable from the Google Now app going into the setting voice uh, I'm sorry uh, voice and now on tap just enable that and uh, for example you have like a name of a celebrity for example like um, Katy Perry for example now when I long press my home button it should uh, wait let me search now it should tell me more about it. Uh, Katy Perry, Ryan Gosling, as you can see. So that does work. And double tap for the voice search from anywhere. So yeah, that still works. To enable it in the settings, just go obviously to the settings app and go to the buttons. And set the home button as you require so I have set the long press action to be the search assistant and the double tap action to be the voice search so yeah you can set it however you want now another feature that we need to enable in the, the development options go into and uh, in setting an about device you just tap the bill number seven times and once that's enabled you go to the developer options and then obviously you if you want root which you obviously do want apps and ADB okay and another exciting marshmallow feature which uh, may take away from you wanting to install the touch was wrong multi window mode now when I tap this icon and I choose the layout two apps will be open side by side and here we get to the next point the camera does not work it does not work at all <clears throat> no matter which app you install but for the time being it does not work so that's why I don't recommend uh, you making this ROM a daily driver Let's also have a look at the Easter egg. So, for the Easter egg, you just jump into the settings about phone and we're 6.01. And it is Marshmallow. As you can see, it is actually Android Marshmallow. So, there. So that's the proof 
that is marshmallow also you can see it says cm13 so yeah unless you don't really want to use the camera for a while until the developers figure it out so otherwise it's pretty good rom it's pretty fast rom so i've got all the features of android marshmallow and also it has a new wallpapers there we are so as always the rom file and the g apps will be linked down in the description below and check out my playlist on the samsung galaxy s4 right over here and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one peace high five